breaks because I need to work on my overhead brakes and stuff like that because obviously they're terrible. So I'm going to be uh, working on stuff like that. So that's what I'm going to do here. So uh, but before we start, I'm going to show you the options and settings as I usually do. So here are the graphic settings here. Uh, turn the color grass back some of That's what I did there. Shadows are on low. That's what I got here. Clouds are on ultra. We got gameplay. So I have everything enabled uh, except unlimited view and unlimited weapons. I do have a mortal checked. So I'm going to show you that right now. So it technically is a cheat, but I do have a check. Uh, so we got birds percent, we are at half. And you know what? Let's turn that up to 1000. Let's turn that up one way. Uh, so that's what we got there. Lips on four as usual. Miscellaneous, is that search? Okay, that's what we got. And then we have audio. So search. Main audio arrow. Do that. Um, oh, did that screw up my... No, it didn't. Okay. Uh, speaker layout, auto, headphones. Let's do that so it's set up properly. And you can still hear me, so good. I had to check that. So that's what we're doing there. Special is as such. Uh, F16C, so we've got custom make constant cockpit is default, can't be tinted as tinted, can't be reflections as static, and we do reflections as static, do it in a detent off, HTMD render eye, I'm gonna do both eyes even though I don't have a, I'm gonna do both eyes even though I don't have a, uh, 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 HM, or, you know, an HMD or whatever. And then we got as such. So without further ado, uh, let's do it. Let's see the news is. I think we'll stable update, nice. Well, jokes on them, I'm not using stable, I'm using open beta. Because most of the multiplayer servers are open beta. On open beta, so that's what I got here. So, um, yeah, let me make the mission and um, I'll see you guys in game. Okay, so I create the mission and uh, obviously this is a new image. It looks really nice. I like it. Uh, so we're starting at 621 2016, 5 o'clock in the morning, at Space. My site is USA. Fight task is nothing, F16 C and Block 50. And we have one UH1H uh, Huey flying around today. Ignore all this stuff here. Uh, I just have this hit so that uh, if I do decide to put this stuff in, uh, I can put it in easily and know what set the frequency is and everything. So we've got temperature 20 degrees Celsius, 2992. Base 1900 with the clouds. And so we've got no wind, no turbulence. So, so we got here, we are Enfield 1. We were Enfield 1. And then uh, frequency is as such. So let's fly. Right. So. Alright, so we are in the sim. So we have uh, 
one uh one h here over there so spring for all on it's gonna do his own little flight it's gonna take off go this way go this way it's basically gonna do two uh, circuits around Nellis Air Force Base and then he's going to come back and land that's gonna be his little flight here Uh, he doesn't have any armaments or anything, or weapons, or anything like that. As for us, we do have weapons and stuff, but we're not going to use them. So, they're just eye candy and for weight, basically. So, so as far as armaments go, on our F-16, we have two M20 Bravo Rams. We have two AIM-9 Lima uh, Sidewinders, Heat Seekers. We have six BD... Okay, sorry, I don't know, I don't remember what it was, but... Uh, so, we are... Um, Uh, we have the S16, we have 6 BD-33 25 pound low drag uh, training bombs uh, with smoke warheads on them and then we have 2 370 gallon uh, fuel tanks on the jet and then finally we have a uh, AOQ-184 jammer pod on the aircraft and then after that we have for our guns we have Target practice tracer rounds. Target practice training tracer rounds or whatever. So yeah, that's that. He's in the air at this point and he's doing his flight plan. He's doing his first second at this point. And then I go to the checklist. Hey, there we go. That's what our jet looks like on the outside with the canopy open. Pretty beautiful jet, in my opinion. I love it. Okay. So, let's do it. Let's go to the canopy. Let's do that first. It's because it's habit. Hold on, let me adjust my track IR. There we go. So we look with the canopy closed. So um, let's do it. Uh, before we actually start though, I'm going to check everything, just kind of do a pre-flight check once around the cockpit, make sure all these switches and knobs and stuff are in the positions that I want them to be before giving power to the jet, just in case. So pre-read off, good, ebugen, good, 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 these are good, trim is good, fuel master, good, interfeed, good. Uh, master, I'll to stand by. You have C and I, I'll do backup because we need to contact the tower for engine start. You can't do this in all modules, I don't think, but this will help. So, uh, lights, the deformation lights off, the refilling door light off, do bright, bright, steady because I like steady. Okay, light off, lights off. Good. Um. Alright, off. Let's turn that off. Turn tack on off. Oh, these are up. Good. Good. Let's turn this up.
Uh, stores config cat three. Okay, that's good. Master arm, autopilot, everything's good there. Everything's good there. I'll turn this up all the way up and then to auto this all the way up. Good, good, auto, good. So, that's that, guys. So, pre flight check is complete. Now we're going to start the jet. Give power to the aircraft. So, main power to battery before start checklist. Main power to battery. Sorry about my sniffles, my ticks are really bad right now. Uh, main power to battery. So, elec, main power switch to battery. FOC, F, aircraft battery 2, F, uh, FOCS radio light on, good. Main gen on, good. Standby gen light on, good. Alright, test. Was this parallel branches A, B, C, D on, good. Aircraft battery 2, FOCS and FOCS PMG lights on, good. Let go. Everything goes back to the way it was. Main power, switch to main power. Uh, Pure gen lights off. Good. Run light off. Uh, Canopy close and lock. Parking brake set. GPS will start to. Okay, parking brake set. And then, either exist and secondary energy short on. Good. Engine hydraulic pressure lights on. Good. So we can start the engine now. But first, we need a contact tower and request clearance to start. So let's do it. So ATC, Nellis, request start. In field, one, one, request startup. Oh, I'm an idiot. Forgot to uh, give power. Good, test that, good. Alright, we're good. Let's do it again. In field, one, one, request startup. Oh, I screwed up. It's some clear for startup. Here these set it, so that's good. So now let's start the jet, pack and break on. I'm gonna turn this back off and switch this to UFC. And then uh, I'm actually gonna try starting with start one this time because I haven't tested it and I don't know if start one works. So let's try it. Start one. Arctic. Turn that on, good. All right, twenty percent idle. What happened to the parking brake? I thought, I thought I did that. It's not. God, that sounds good. Uh, engine is normal. Good. Looks pretty good. Hit that master caution. Uh, to a switch check off, good. Oxygen, normal, good. Probe heat switch to probe heat. Let's check probe heat off, good. Light off, probe heat to probe heat. Probe heat, good, off. Okay, test. 
Flashing good, let go. Uh, finally detect test push button, let's do it. Master caution on, engine fire on, overheat on, good, let go. Let's go off. Let's check the old box, see if they fixed it yet. No, they did not, god damn it. Interestingly, back in 2020, the oxy low light worked fine, at least on stable. Now it doesn't work at all. Uh, it doesn't work at all when you do the bit switch. It works if you actually do oxygen 100% and lose the oxygen, it works, but it doesn't work at the bit test. I'm going to have to file a bug report for that if it hasn't been done already. And then. A function indicated lights test. Let's do it. Check for bump bulbs. Pull up. Altitude. Warning. Now you see, my light doesn't come on. That's a little weird. Should. Low. Out. Lock. Caution. Bingo. Data. I F F. Okay. Avionics switches. Uh, Avionics switches all six on. Okay. MMC, STSDA, MFD, UFC, GPS, data link, mids, OVT on. Uh, and this to normal. Damn, that hood looks good. AJ INS align, C line or BFC. Good, already did that. Landing gear down with three green, good. Um, speed brakes check. Speed brake, that board's up. That board's up, good. Let's watch them retract. Retracted, retracted, and uh, retracted. Okay. ADI and SO uncage. So uncage. That's good. Um, left hole point switch, where hard point switch as required, FCR switch, FCR, and. Uh, radar altimeter switch, radar altimeter, okay, on, get the FCI off, engineer second, second, uh, engine secondary engine control, uh, check, second, pry, hate doing this, it's annoying, um, alright, uh, secondary, All right, hold the brakes up a little bit. All right, that worked fine. Let me bring this down. I'm at it. Uh, um, okay, back back on. Okay, there we go. Close position goes back up. Uh, I forgot to check the lights, but it's. I'm sure the lights worked fine. Uh, uh, FLCS cycle and check. Alright. Hello. Elevator. Ailerons. Uh, FC is bit, bit. So test it. So on. Run. Wonder, can I use the controls? Right controls? No? No, I cannot. Can I use. Uh, can I use speed brakes and stuff? No, I cannot. 
so it prohibits me using it while it's doing the bit. Okay, that's nice. Fuel quantity tests, normal. Forward, fuel low, our fuel low light's good. Plus or minus. So it's 6,000. Plus or minus 100 pounds. Okay, that's good. Let's go off, good. Uh, digital backup switch, back up and then off. Okay, keep you on. Light on, good. Warning, good. Let's test, make sure everything works. Good. TV off. Light off, good. Um. Trim, AP disc, disc. Uh, I'm not going to deal with the trim. I don't use trim in the F-16 ever. Uh, MPO test, which override test, so override. All right, stick forward. Sorry, I have to do this with one hand. Forward. And let go. Good. And then finally, EPU. Test that, and then EPU off. Alright, so brakes, um, brakes, throw it up a little bit, EPU gen test on, air light, run light on, good, flashes aren't good, let go, run light off, alright, throw it idle, okay, break a break on. So that worked fine. IFF on and set. Steel lights as required. So IFF on and set. So I'm going to turn it to normal at this point. Okay. Uh, config cat1, cat3, EW, RDR, RD, jammer on. Good. It's code set. Bingo set. Okay. Let's set bingo real quick. Attack on ILS on and set, alternative set, ETI, INS to nav, NWS on. Let's do NWS on. Uh, let's check this. Alright, that's good. That's good. Now we just wait. We wait for the INS to finish aligning. Usually it doesn't take this long, usually it's done by now. But it's only uh whatever it was. Let's see how do I get that list INS six INS. We're almost done. So we're just gonna wait till it finishes. Well, look at that yet. This is probably his second, so he's probably going to come back and land at this point. Aligned. All right. Nav. Okay. We're good.
sir. Okay. So we're ready to taxi. But first, I'm going to actually have a sandwich. Sandwich, not gonna lie. <laughs> kind of hungry, so I'm gonna have a sandwich real quick. Actually, before I do that, before I my sandwich, let me get clearance to taxi real quick. In field one one, request taxi to runway. I don't know what's going on with the uh, ATC, it's a little weird. It's not like exactly finishing what he's saying, but whatever. But we got our taxi clearance, so. Uh, I'm out of my sandwich now. I'll do this so you can watch him land. That's fucking cool. I'm not sure what he's doing. It's not weird. Not what he's doing. Okay, I don't think he knows how to land. I don't think he knows how to land, so... Uh, I guess he's gonna run out of fuel and crash at some point. But it would be hours before that happens. Not one way in the air. But anyways. Oh, has he got it? Has he got it? Or maybe he's trying to land in my spot. So, okay. I can't tell what he's trying to do, but. Anyways, we're ready for the taxi. So, without further ado, let's do it, guys. Alright, let's taxi. Break off. God, that sound sounds good. Just the runway that oh he wanted he wanted three right that's right. He wanted it to now oh, it's not now right yeah. I love how you got the uh, wing flexes and stuff. Pack a break on. Yeah, I don't know what he's doing. It's being weird. Uh, Alright, so after start checklist, okay. So before takeoff checklist, flaps normal. Uh, tr so flaps normal, good. Trim needles centered, good. Uh, uh, edge of control primary, good. Uh, speed rate closed, good. Fuel panel, normal, good. Oxygen on. Oxygen is on, it's been on. 
Okay. Protection seat on. Alright, get through that light. Perv heat on. On. Radar on. No. Throttle 90%. Brakes release. Mobile afterburner. 70 knots. Uh, and reverse off. Okay. Alright, we're ready. Let's do it. Quest takeoff. In field, one, one. Request takeoff. Yeah, it's all buggy. That's weird. Clear for takeoff and ready. Climb through the zero two eight zero two. Watcher. All right. Break off. Let's do it, guys. It's gonna be hard. I'm not good at overhead brakes. In fact, I'm terrible at them. Since we're so heavy, we'll... the hell? Since we're so heavy, we're going to do a uh, burn. So, so without further ado, let's do it. So brakes on. So ninety. All right, brakes off. Full burn. Off. You rotate. Okay, mill power. Okay, gear up. test that even though I shouldn't shouldn't do it like that We're flying has he landed yet? No, I think he landed. I don't know. So, for this stuff, I'm not going to use the ATC. I'm going to land uncontrolled and everything. So I'm not going to contact tower or whatever for landing until the final landing. Because it just would make... It's just a pain in the ass. Yep, he landed. So I was in his spot. I'm pretty shit at overhead brakes. I'll do the long runway. Yep, he finally landed. What a miracle. So let me go this way. Way too high up for this, but it's okay. Let's 
Altitude. Altitude. Yep, he landed. Beautiful. He landed on a helipad. Hell yeah. Alright. Three, two, one, break. Try to keep the same angle of attack. Get down. You know, for the first one, that wasn't that, that wasn't too bad. And I'm fully heavy too, so that makes it even more difficult. All right, let's go. Going pretty good so far. Uh, pull a little more. I have a shot. God damn it. So the idea with overhead brakes is the idea is to bleed off his speed. That's the whole idea, is to bleed off your speed. Um, angle of attack is fine, but my sink rate's a little high. That wasn't, that wasn't, that wasn't great, but it also wasn't too bad either. Oh god. Oh, that was a hard landing. I didn't damage the gear, did I? No. Gear up. Let's try again. We'll do five overheads. And then land. Five at least, anyway. So that was one. Fun, man. That actually wasn't too bad. That was actually the best regular overhead break that I've ever done. It was pretty smooth, not gonna lie. I remember when I was showing Cliff how to fly and I showed him an overhead break, it was just god awful. I just yanked back on the stick and almost crashed and everything. Yeah, it was bad. <laughs> Fast jet, oh my god. Doesn't like to slow down either. Favorite fucking aircraft, guys. And for good reason, too. It's just beautiful. Got this huge bubble canopy, you can see everything. You know? This is gorgeous.
I'll do 1500 feet red out this time. Alright, let's turn around. Actually, I don't think I'll make it like this. No, I won't. So I'm going to turn over here just a little bit. Go this way. And then I'm going to do a nice big turn around to the left. So I'm going to do that. Fly out a little bit. Wait, is my why is my angle of attack indicator working? Why is my angle of attack indicator on right now? I just realized that angle of attack indicator is on right now. Why? My gear is up. That's a bug. shouldn't be on right now. No question lights or anything. It's too bad I don't have like PFOD working right now. The, the pilot force display, too bad that's not implemented right now. It's gonna lower the nose. Nuclear reactors or something. It's dusty. It's hard to see. <clears throat> Let's go up to 300 knots. Fifteen hundred feet, 300 knots. My flight path vector is not working right. right. Actually, it's fine. Never mind. Three, two, one, break. You're done. Okay. Good. All right, let's do it. Oh shit.
Let me land. I'll do that now. Sorry about that. Uh, let's fix my truck out right here. All right, let's uh, let's continue. See, my fuelers have been sitting here forever. Nine thousand, we're good. All right, so pack and break off. We're at the end of the race. You can basically just turn around. Earth map, guys. I'm so into that. Can't wait for it. Alright, fall down. Oh, I forgot to turn those just off. <laughs> what do you know? The helicopter. Uh, the helicopter is gone. Despawned. Glad he landed at least. Let's go back around. We're a little bit more maneuverable because we burnt some fuel sitting there. Nice, if only I could roll out like this uh, when doing the overhead brake, it'd be perfect. It's 
that was the second one that we did. One, two, three, break. I don't know what's with my ego attack indicator. I don't know why it's still working. Shouldn't. You're down. It's actually not bad at all. Alright, let's do it. Actually, this is kind of close, but let's do it anyway. Oh, this might be a good one. Although I'm losing altitude pretty rapidly. Ever shooting again? God damn it! And this is turned horrible. <laughs> Normally I wouldn't land with something like this, but My bags are probably empty. This is pretty immersive. I love it. Get too fast here.
Alright, let's go in. I think we did three already. I think. I may be off by one, but I'm not sure. Hey, a train! Oh shit! Got trains now! Fuck yeah! That's dope! The train cap conductor is probably like, oh shit, F-16. Doing it a little bit higher this time just so I can do this properly. Three, two, one, break. Not doing too bad this time. Just roll out here this time. The reason I like the F 16 so much is so easy to fly. It's a dream to fly, but a bitch to fight in. That's a quote. I don't remember by who, but it's a dream to fly, but a bitch to fight in. We're already at the angle of attack we need, basically. I'm gonna fly out here for a little bit. Oh, this is pretty much perfect. Let's go. Right. 
scroll out just a little bit. A little too fast. Oh. Put that on the put it on the threshold ice. Come on, you got this. You have a straight line to the threshold, come on. You got this. You got this baby. You got this. Hey, that wasn't bad at all. That wasn't bad at all. 2.5 degrees. A little bit. We're not exactly there, but... We're not exactly at 2.5 degrees. Angle of attack or whatever. But... We are... Pretty good there. This is pretty good. Not gonna lie, this is the best one thus far. Practice makes better, right? First time I've ever done overheads, really, you know, practice them. And I'm doing it on camera. God, this is beautiful. I'm gonna flip it up just a little bit. All right, all right, take off again. Altitude, altitude. I remember when I used to put the gear up and the jet would do this, you know, that scared the shit out of me. I almost crashed a couple of times when that happened. I thought that was the way the jet was supposed to respond, but thinking about it, aerodynamically, it's not supposed to be that abrupt. Supposed to you lose lifts uh, gradually, not like it's not supposed to put the nose down. Is that a thing? One more overhead break with the touch and go, and then uh, we'll come in for a regular landing. a fun flight. I'm enjoying it. See, there's the train. Oh, there's two trains. Shit. It's pretty cool.
see, let's make the fifth one nice. Let's make the last one nice. If not, it's okay. You know, fourth one is almost perfect. Fourth one is really, really good. I was impressed with that. Last one, guys. Let's make it count. Stay at 1500 AGO. Three, two, one, break. Watching the flight path marker, making sure it's staying relatively on the horizon line. Oh, a little sloppy. Come on, ice. For my jets automatically trimming so it can get the angle of attack. That's pretty damn sweet. It's gonna stay at 200 knots. Uh, a little bit more, probably 10 seconds more. Alright, let's go. I like the F-16 because when you land you don't have to trim. Trimming in a jet is fucking annoying. Especially when you've got like trim in the Hornet. You know, when you land. It's fucking annoying, I hate it. That's why I don't fly the Hornet. I mean, it's a beautiful aircraft. I like it. I can fly the Hornet. I just hate doing it. My gosh, this is beautiful. This is oh, I'm getting chills. Two and a half degree line on the fucking threshold. I'm just gonna rest my uh, angle of attack. Make I'm taking an exit there. Oh, my flight path marker. Sorry. There we go. Just like that. Fifth one has been so gorgeous so far. This is going to be a beautiful landing, guys. Wow. And to think this is the first time me actually doing overhead breaks other than the training mission. That one time. This is pretty damn good. I forgot the speed brakes and stuff, but it's okay. Oh, it's a little rough. It's a little rough. It's okay. 
take off one more time. Gear up. We'll do it once around Vegas and then uh, come back in a regular pattern and land. Not an overhead pattern, but just a regular pattern, you know. So the fifth one was great up until the landing and the actual touchdown, because the touchdown was a little bit rough. But uh, other than that, it was okay. around Vegas here. I'm sweet. Technically, I'm not supposed to go over the top of another airspace like this, but I'm going to do it since there's no aircraft. Change my air load of one thousand. God, this jet's gorgeous. We're gonna love the F sixteen. Those clouds are good.
is. Now let's let's contact the tower. Infield one one inbound. Yeah, that could have visual contact tower. Let's see, can I request landing from here? In field one one, request landing. <laughs> no. This is it, guys. Last landing. We're gonna land on the same runway. Oh, get in. Come on. In field one one, request landing. Good to land. Field two one. Come on. Alright, there we go. Break. Beautiful. I don't know what's with the fucking... The radio communications are weird.
All right. I can't taxi to parking it, or um, I can't taxi to take off again. This kind of sucks. Okay. Thought they had that before, but guess not. Click it back on. So, all right, that's it, guys. So, I shut down the jet. All right, some more off. 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 Up. Off. Off. And then, uh, that must question. Engine off. God, that sounds awesome. Let's take it off. Oh, fuck. I wasn't supposed to do that yet. Shit. I just screwed it up because you have to keep this on the battery on on main power to main power whatever you have to keep that on until the nozzle reaches below 20% uh, throttle and if you don't you fuck it up so I just screwed up the jet creatures can be pissed <coughs> oh well uh, so off 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 uh, off keep those I just leave everything else But yeah, let's check outside. Did I screw it up? Oh no. It's fine. Oh, I love the sound of the heat. On the jet. Or oh, the fans still spinning. That's awesome. I don't know if you heard those clicking noises, but that's what that was. At least I think. Or was the turbine still spinning? Then the final thing we need to do, kind of be up. Unlock up. Pretty awesome. All right, guys, we did it. That's all for this part. Uh, it's pretty cool. It's all for this part. If you liked it, smash like button, like a badass. Leave a comment. I'll see you guys next time. Farewell.